On Saturday night, Providence Hockey captured the most significant championship in the history of Rhode Island. They did it the right way and they did it the hard way. And on Sunday, they began to enjoy the fruits of their labor. And Providence took what I'm sure was a very enjoyable bus ride home on Sunday from Boston. And upon returning to campus, they were greeted by adoring fans, screaming children and J.P. Smallins. Three weeks ago, they were on the fence looking for help to get into the NCAA tournament. Four wins later, and Providence College is now the national champion. 30 years after losing a heartbreaker in the final to RPI, the Friars are the undisputed kings of college hockey. I mean, we had a bumpy road along the way. I mean, it was tough, but uh, we felt that we deserved to be in there. And uh, I think we showed everyone why we should be there. And uh, those four games just went by so quickly, and it's such unbelievable. I think it kind of sunk in on the bus ride back to campus. Uh, Last night was just a moment where we got to all hang out with our families, all the fans, and just kind of be thankful for this opportunity and uh, represent Providence College and uh, we're national champions. It's a team effort all the way around, you know, like I want to thank all of our fans. I want to thank, um, I had a tremendous staff this year and I, I want to thank them. They were, they were outstanding and, um, you know, it's just, I think it's great for Rhode Island. It's great for Rhode Island hockey. It's, uh, you know, it's great for our school. You know, it's, uh, it's a lot of our athletic programs are really taking off right now, and we're happy to be one of them. A 49 save effort and Frozen Four MVP honors could be John Gillies' final act as a friar. The Calgary Flames draft pick expected to sign with the team this week. Yeah, that's a decision that'll come in the next few days, but right now I'm just focused on enjoying this with this wonderful group of guys here and uh, just going from there. The school will hold a championship celebration for the team here at Schneider on Tuesday. The doors open at 3 with the event beginning at 4 o'clock. At Providence College, I'm J.P. Smollins, Eyewitness Sports.